Hey guys, what's up? This is White Boy for the win, and welcome back to Why Mega Evolve. Now, earlier last week we talked about Mega Quillfish, and today we're going to be talking about Mega Persian. But before we get started, let me just give you guys a brief explanation of what this series is about. Now, every week I will be picking two Pokemon that either need a Mega Evolution, deserve a Mega Evolution, or want a Mega Evolution 4. Now, this is based off my opinion, my opinion alone, and no one else's. Now, if you guys do not like my opinion, then please post your opinions in the comment section down below about what would you keep, what would you change and etc. And at the end of every video I will be telling you guys which Pokemon we're going to be talking about the following day. So with that said, here is Mega Persian. Now to be honest, I'm actually very surprised that I haven't talked about Persian yet, considering that one of the most iconic Pokemon is Meowth, and Persian is the evolved form of Meowth. So once again, I think I kind of fucked up, and, and so and I'm very surprised that I haven't talked about it yet. But regardless, it's here now. So as you can tell from what I've done to its stats, I did increase everything because honestly, everything needed to get increased. So uh, with all that said, let's just get into its stats. So for its physical attack, I increased it from base 70 to base 110. Now, Persian is a very hard hitting Pokemon because I actually used to run a Persian on a team. I had like Jolly Nature, Max Attack, Max Speed with a Life Orb, and it had the Technician ability. And like Fake Out, Return, U Turn, and I believe either Knock Off or Seed Bomb. I had those moves, and it did a lot of damage considering that its physical attack was at base 70. So, Increasing into base 110, it's just going to be a very hard hitting Pokemon. And honestly, I'm surprised Persian's physical attack before Mega Evolving uh, would have been like at least base like base 90, 95. Uh, but I, once again, uh, I still think it should have been higher. But regardless, uh, for its Mega Evolution, I decided to actually have it at base 110. Now for its special attack, I increased it from base 65 to base 95. Now to be honest, I've seen some people run special Persian. And I honestly think it could work. I mean, it's just five points shy uh, from its physical attack before Mega Evolving. So increasing it to base 95 isn't going to hurt all that much. Because like I said, when it comes to like normal type Pokemon, uh, and I'm pretty sure Persian is an exception. It does get access to uh, like a very good variety of moves. But I know it gets access to like Thunderbolt. And uh, I, I think that's the only moves. Thunderbolt. <sighs> this is killing me. I can't remember which moves it gets access to. Uh, let me just look it up real quick it gets access to like thunderbolt shadow ball uh and that's pretty much it uh, when it comes to the special side because it's more like of a physical attacker but besides that if you want to go with like a special uh uh, Persian, you can. I mean, it, do, it is doable, and it also gets access to Icy Wind and Hyper Voice uh, and Shock Wave and Water Pulse. So you can run those moves if you wanted to. But once again, uh, base 95 for a special attack, a special Persian can work. If you want to run a mixed Persian, then you can. But I, I, I want to actually increase its special attack. That way, you can go either physical or special. If you want to go mixed, you can. Now, for its physical defense, I only increased it a little bit from base 60 to base 70. Uh, there's like no matter like what I increase, including its special defense, it's still gonna be a very, very, very frail Pokemon. It's pretty much going to be like Mega Absol. It's gonna be a very hard hitting Pokemon and very speedy Pokemon. But the one thing that's actually killing it is its defenses, and it's gonna get like pretty much destroyed in one shot coming from like a like a Mock Punch or a Vacuum Wave or whatever the case may be. It's gonna get bopped. So. Uh, regardless of what I increase it to, base 70 or like even base 90 for uh, for example, it's still going to get uh, pretty much destroyed in one hit. Now for its special defense, I increase it from base 65 to base 95. Now you probably are going to dis disagree with that, and you should and you're probably going to be saying that I should have gave base 95 to its physical defense rather than its special defense, considering it is normal and it is going to get. And the only thing technically weak to it is pretty much fighting, which is mostly like physical type attacks. But regardless. Uh uh, I still think I should increase the special defense more because of, of the added typing I've given it, which I'll get to in a sec. So with base 95 special defense, it, it's still going to be very, very frail because it is a Persian. But at the same time, it is going to have a little bit more bulk to it than it would have being at like base 65 or even base 60. So regardless, base 95 is actually pretty decent in my opinion. Now for its speed, I increased it from base 115 to base 125. Now just like its defense, I only increased it just a tad bit because Persian is 
fast as hell as it is already at base 115 so increasing it over like base 125 even a base over base 130 would be a little bit too much but regardless I only increase it to uh, 10 points to base 125 because it's still gonna be a very very fast Pokemon and I mean very fast Pokemon base 125 is through their fucking roof if I do say so myself when it comes to speed but regardless I only increased it just a little bit because I didn't want to overly dramatically increase in speed so I left it at base 125 now for a regular Persian it's base that's at 440 uh, 440 and with the mega evolution it's gonna be at 540 now for its ability I given it the, uh, I left it alone and given it the technician ability because honestly I think technician is, is a very good ability for Persian because it does get access to fake out and fake out does get boosted from the technician ability and I honestly think uh, it's just a very good ability all around I mean it does get access to moves that are below base 60 I mean I'm pretty sure it does get access to uh, fan attack which is a, like a base 60 move which like I said it is a base 60 move because I am looking on Serebi right now so you can run like uh, uh, fake out uh, assurance uh, what else uh, what's that move? Fan attack. I mean, there's just a lot of moves that you can run on Persian that can get boosted from the technician ability. And so I decided to give it technician. Now, I'm pretty sure a lot of people are probably going to say I should have given it fur coat. But once again, I honestly think that technician is the better ability here. Now, for its typing, I actually added on the dark type characteristics because for one of two reasons. One, if you watch the anime, Meowth is part of Team Rocket, which is an evil organization and when you when I think of evil evil I think of dark so dark actually fits Persian and Giovanni's like main Pokemon would say is Persian so uh, it kind of fits the bill right there and also Persian does get access to quite a few dark time moves if I say so myself like I said it does get access to bite Bain attack, uh, assurance, night slash, and even one of the best dark type moves in the game, which is knockoff. So I decided to give it the dark type characteristics because, it, like I said, it does get access to dark type moves that can be beneficial to that typing and also be a stab as well. And it gets access to one of the best dark type moves in the game, which is knockoff. So that also is going to get boosted from the dark uh, from the stab because it, yeah, because it, it is going to be uh, part dark. So with all that said, there is Mega Persian. So anyways, guys. Thank you guys so much for watching. If you guys enjoyed this video, don't forget to hit that like button. Also, don't forget to comment and subscribe. Now, if you guys missed the previous Why Mega Evolve video, which was Mega Quillfish, it is going to be in the description box down below, so you guys can go and check it out. And I also have, I also made a Twitch, which is also going to be in the description box down below, so you guys can go give me a follow. I am going to be going live very, very soon. I don't have a set date yet, but it will be much appreciated if you guys can go give me a follow because it will notify you once I go live, but I will have a video on YouTube soon saying I am going to be live on Twitch but regardless I do have a Twitch and I am going to be going live soon so you guys should go and give me a follow so when it comes to the next Pokemon it is still going to be from first gen and honestly it's one of my favorite I mean I always say that when it comes to Pokemon because I really love Pokemon and that one is uh, and the next Pokemon we're going to be talking about is Muck. So yes, uh, I, n later down the line this week, we are going to be talking about Muck. So with all that said, like I said, thank you guys so much for watching. If you guys enjoyed this video, don't forget to hit that like button. Also, don't forget to comment and subscribe. So this is White Boy for the win, and I'll catch you guys later.